It's a way to tackle gun violence involving youth in the city of Richmond. City Council just committed more than $600,000 in funding to help support youth in the community. 8 News reporter Cheyenne Pagan spoke with city leaders and brings us the details. After multiple shootings in April involving teenagers in the city, leaders say these financial investments are needed now more than ever. We have to be tough on crime and we have to be tough on the root causes of crime. Richmond Mayor LeVar Stoney hopes to accomplish this by funding youth programs in the city. He says this all began in 2022 when they released their gun violence prevention and intervention framework, aiming to fund these types of programs for years to come. I'm glad to see a few years out from releasing that uh, framework that we are continuing to double down on those investments. In the city of Richmond's 2025 budget, $370,000 will be committed to We Matter RVA, a program focused on gun violence prevention for at-risk youth. This is a parks and recreation program that involves mentorship, uh, involves teaching them the ways of getting away from the violent communities that they may come from. It's a worthwhile investment because we want to ensure our kids have everything they need to thrive in our community. $250,000 and will go towards building a new gym in Whitcomb Court, an area impacted by gun violence recently. We just want to make sure that the children have a safe space to be able to play and um, live their lives and not really deal with a lot of the trauma. Richmond City Councilwoman Ann Francis Lambert says she hopes that the city will see a return on these investments by seeing a decrease in crime. We want to make sure the guns are not in our children's hands and they are doing some positive activities in the afternoon um, where a lot of the crimes are occurring. The $370,000 the city is committing to We Matter RVA will be split in multiple ways. You can find some more information on our website at WRIC.com on how they're utilizing that money. In Richmond, Cheyenne Pagan, 8 News.